Hey everyone, Mike Sherry here at Paul Sherry Commercial Vehicles and uh, got a really nice brand new Ram. This is a 2500 chassis, does have the big crew cab on it and it is upfitted with the Redding service body on the back. So at uh, the start of this video, I'm going to uh, talk about the service body, what it is, what makes it different uh, than the rest and uh, out there and then we'll get into uh, the Ram truck side. So the service body is a Redding service body. It's a single wheel uh, service body. Uh, there's different types of service bodies out there and we've got a lot of commercial vehicles here uh, and the Redding is kind of the Cadillac of service body. This is a classic two, uh, which means it's the galvanized steel. So it's the A60 galvanized steel. So you've got different constructions you can have on a service body. You can have an aluminum, which is good for anti-corrosion, right? Aluminum doesn't corrode, but it's not as strong as steel. So then you have steel, which is really strong, but it'll rust on you. And then you have this, this is kind of a hybrid. This is uh, what they call the galvanized steel. So it's like galvanized steel, but it's even stronger and able to be painted. And it has anti-corrosion properties of galvanized steel and the strength of steel. So super great option, probably in my opinion, the best option. And I'd say this is uh, the most popular option out there. Uh, so the Reading service bodies will have, uh, show you here. This particular one has the optional keyless entry here. This is for just the service body here. So you can lock all the doors at once and unlock them all at once. You can also individually lock them. There is a lock on each one as well, which is really nice. And then also you can turn on and off the lights here. So that's a nice feature. All right, so get in here. It has galvanized shelves that are adjustable. You can hold, I believe, 200 pounds. Uh, the Hinges on the Redding, one thing that separates them is they have custom hinges that are adjustable. A lot of uh, companies just use like a piano style hinge that you really would have to replace and then get painted. It's kind of expensive. This is just simply adjustable as uh, you know, the door gets used and may, it might need adjusted. It does have a gas uh, strut to keep the door open. And then the door itself is a double walled door uh, so it's really strong if I would pry put my foot and arm up here it doesn't move it's a very sturdy built door and then you have a protector here for your latch system so your tools if they bang into it, it's not going to mess it up uh, notice the handle here it's showing orange that's telling me hey this door's not closed all the way as I close the door the orange goes away now if it just be popped open just a little bit you're always going to have that orange warning so a nice feature with the Redding box now this box here it's one of my favorites. Doubles as a workstation. That's a nice height. If I need to do some paperwork on the job site, it's going to be just fine there. It does have releasable uh, chains here uh, with the chain protector, so it's not going to dent or scratch all up the paint on your door. Uh, so those can be removed and flip all the way down as well. Same style adjustable hinges as you can see, and then another adjustable shelf. In the back storage compartment, again, we got a light here, adjustable shelf does have holes down on the floor so you can hose this off does have the protector here for your brake and tail lights and then here you kind of have a little bit of access into the other spot so if you got a long tool uh, you're going to be able to fit it in that compartment very easily you see here I don't have the door shut all the way it's showing a little bit of a little bit of orange so all right as we get in the back got a nice big steel bumper has a slam latch tailgate here Diamond plate floor, nice big bed, nice built in tie downs here, LED tail brake and reverse lights. And coming down here, it's got your big two and a half inch receiver there, uh, nice big receiver. And then it does have factory wiring with your seven and your four pin. And then coming over here, uh, these storage boxes are just the same as what we saw on the other side. Uh, does have your fuel fill over here. Uh, and then here we've got, uh, it, it describes the different things I told you about. One thing I didn't mention, this does have a six year limited warranty by Redding on the service body. All right, let's get into the pickup truck, the Ram side of it. So it is, again, the crew cab does have the 6.4 liter V8 gasoline engine. Uh, a lot of our customers prefer this engine over the Cummins diesel because maintenance is a lot less money on this. I've seen the maintenance bills on the diesels in the shop and uh, they usually are four digit bills. So very rarely do you get out in the hundreds. It's usually the thousands of dollars. Uh, 
uh, just for a normal service. So it's nice having this gasoline powered V8 Hemi. It's the largest offering uh, for V8 by Ram. It does have the chrome out bumper and front uh, grill. All that looks good. All right, let's jump inside and we'll take a peek. Again, brand new track, so it's going to have full warranty from Ram. It does have push button start. And I should mention, I showed you, get it out of my pocket here, I showed you the keyless entry from the Redding side. It also has keyless entry on the Ram side. All right, see so 106 miles. Uh, so brand new truck has uh, power windows, locks, mirrors are power. Uh, the mirrors are also tow haul, so they'll flip out, uh, you manually flip them out. So if you're hauling a trailer, you can see around. Uh, and then automatic headlights. And then here we've got cruise control and gearing control on the steering wheel, as well as your hands-free connectivity. Nice soft touch steering wheel. Uh, does have a five inch screen with Bluetooth capabilities and AM and FM has a built in compass as you can see here as well. And then uh, volume tuning, heat and air conditioning controls. Yes, it does have that. So this is electronic brake controller. A very nice option from the factory. That's going to allow your brakes to work on your trailer that you're pulling when you hit the brake pedal. And I like that it's factory, not aftermarket, because the aftermarket ones go right here by your knee in it. And I always bang them. So uh, we have a uh, eight-speed automatic transmission control, four-wheel drive control right beside that, and then a push-button start. You do have six auxiliary inputs if you want to add different lighting and things like that. There's factory plugs for all that stuff. And factory button so everything looks nice you don't have a bunch of aftermarket buttons in here it does have usb controllers and a change organizer down here and then you do have a nice center console padded top and usb power and change organizers three beverage holders and then this flips up this will make this a six passenger so you have three passengers across the front and then three across the back the seats on this are all commercial grade seats it's a vinyl seat very durable the flooring throughout is going to be the rubber flooring so you literally can hose this out if you have to uh, if you're interested in financing a lot of our customers who watch these videos uh, maybe can't come in the store just because they live far away so we have uh, financing options online i'll post the link to that below um yeah if you like our content and uh would like to see more just subscribe to our page and we'll get you set up there and uh, if you have any comments just comment down below and if you have specific questions, by all means, call in, email in. We'll get right back with you. So, all right. These are hard to come by right now. And it's a, a great chassis with a great service body. Probably the best out there on the service body side. Uh, best option for longevity and use. So, thank you so much for watching. And uh, look forward to hearing from you soon.